What's up, Gemini? Thanks for tuning in to Get Your Vibes with Friend. You already know it's your motherfucking girl, Serenity Tiara, aka the Tarot Fairy, aka your fairy godmother. But you can call me Friend, and I'm back to y'all with another video. So, y'all already know this is a love specific reading for the week of the 7th through the 13th. How I'm going to break it down is I'm going to do your overall theme. Hold on, let me move this one because that was for Libra. I'm going to do your overall theme, okay, for the week. Then we're just going to pull the overall messages. Then I'm going to pull some advice. Then I'm going to let y'all ask a question and I'm going to give you that yes, no, maybe so. Okay. So, yeah, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend. Turn them post, turn them bit. Turn that bell on for post notifications, okay? Hit the link in my bio or my description, depending on what platform you are on, okay? Um, yeah, if you would like to book a personal reading, that's what I was trying to say. Hit the link in my bio if you would like to book a personal reading. Um, if you don't and you know somebody else that do, send in the link. Don't be stingy. All right, Gemini, so what's up and welcome back. I'm going to go ahead and cleanse the energy. If you do not want to hear the sound of the bell, just, you know, turn your phone down or your TV, whatever that you're watching it on. Okay. <clears throat> All right, Gemini, so what is... So I'm going to start. <clears throat> All right, Gemini. So I'm going to start with the archetypes for the overall theme for your love life this week. What is the overall theme for Gemini's love life the week of the 7th through the 13th? What is the overall theme for Gemini's love life? Ooh, I have never seen this card before. All right, so we have the vision. At the back of the deck, we have the fault line. So I'm going to put your theme here so you can just keep looking at it. This card is beautiful. I'm going to let you get a closer look. Hold on. All right. So we got the vision. Hold on, because let me look at this for a second. I've never seen this card before. <clears throat> I'm not going to lie. This is giving me twin flame vibes. This is giving me soulmate vibes, okay? Spiritual connection, okay? Vision, the vision. Yeah, even with it being the vision, this could be something that you intuitively new already or you could be with someone that y'all intuitively have ha, like knew the vision of y'all's relationship already okay then at the back of the deck we have the fault line here i'm not really sure what that's about i'm gonna put that here just so y'all can see kind of see that as well a little bit okay and um let's just go ahead and get into it so spirit what what is the overall messages? What would be going on in Gemini's love life this week? What would be going on in Gemini's love life for the week of the 7th through the 13th? What will be going on in Gemini's love life, sun, moon, and rising, and Venus, for the week of the 7th through the 13th? Should I take all of these? I'm like, should I, though? I'm a, I'm a, yeah, I'm a, um, yeah, I'm a redo that. If it's meant to come back out, they will come back out, but for some reason, I just don't feel called to take those. What is going on with Gemini's love life? Okay. Okay, I'll take that to start. So we have the Four of Cups. We also have the Justice. Okay, I knew the Justice would probably come back out. Okay. And back of the deck, we have the Six of Wands. This is giving me, like, you knew there was Justice... <sighs> 
Okay, hold on. Ooh, okay, one, two, three, four, five. We got the five of swords. This could be a situation, and then at the back of the deck, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight of cups. Okay, this could be a situation where, um, like I said, with this vision card, I feel like this is so accurate um, <laughs> right now to this reading with the energy that I'm feeling. Um, I feel like there was some sort of loss, okay? <sighs> Excuse me. I feel like there was some sort of loss. There was some sort of doubt or defeat within your love life, Gemini. But I feel like even through that defeat, even through that doubt, you still knew, like you always knew, for one, you always knew your worth, okay? And for two, I feel like if this is if this has to deal with a specific person, no, let me not even say that. You always knew know knew your worth, Gemini, okay? And um I think because you know that <clears throat> or because you always knew that, um spirit is going to be bringing something in for you. Okay? Because we have the justice here right after the 4 of uh cups. So this is something that you're not going to miss. Like this is something that is like you, like you're going to you're you're definitely going to see it. Um and it's definitely going to be presented to you and you're definitely going to accept it, okay? With this justice card here. Let's clarify this um weird 5 of wands. I mean swords energy though. Let's clarify 5 of swords. Let's clarify 5 of swords. I don't, okay, I don't know why for some, yeah, I, yeah, I was feeling that energy. Okay, so we got the four of pinnacles, and then we also have the devil card at the back of the deck. I don't know why for some people, this could be you, Gemini. If it is, I'm not judging, okay? Whoever it is, I'm not judging. Someone here could have done, um... I don't know why I just heard root work, but I was trying to say like evil magic. Um, someone here could have done root work or evil magic. Okay. To win, to win you over or to get back with you. Or you could have done this for someone else. Okay. Yeah, some yeah, someone was hurt in a situation and uh they could have done some weird stuff <laughs> to the person that left them. Okay, this could look, Gemini, if it's you, I'm not judging you. I know y'all got two different personalities, so you know, but um yeah <laughs> we got the judgment though, so um <laughs> Back of the deck, we got um, two of swords. Matter of fact, let me clarify this judgment real quick. Ooh, judgment with the five of, of ooh, okay, ace of wands, ace of cups. Okay, <clears throat> so we got the judgment, we got the five of wands, and then we got the ace of wands. And then at the back of the deck, we got the ace of cups. I'm going to show y'all that just because that's, that's good energy for y'all to see. Okay. So, um, yeah, spirit, God, whoever you believe in is coming in and they clean this shit up. This, I'm looking at this like brooms right now. They coming in with a brooms. <laughs> I'm looking at this like upside down. Like if you see like most of them, they're like kind of looking up. Well, not most of them, but this person over here, they're looking up and this is giving me vibes like your spirit team is like looking down at y'all and they're like using the brooms to like clean shit up. That's the vibes that is giving me. OK, um, whatever's going on right now, there's definitely um, a lot of work behind the scenes in the spiritual realm going on. This could even be like spiritual warfare. OK, between you and your person. OK. Um, if there is a specific person that you are dealing with, it could be a situation where it's literally spiritual warfare, like the like evil energy, negative energy, the devil energy 
fighting with heavenly divine loving energy uh, okay and one of you could have represented one the other person could have represented the other okay if it's not that um like i said this is just a situation where there's a lot of stuff going on behind the scenes um and there's also i feel like a lot of things that you don't really know um if you have complete like if you're completely over a person or if you have um completely moved on from a person and there was like no you you know that there was like no weird stuff no magic or whatever involved with it then this is just saying that um spirit is coming in to really like like pull shit in for you not only are they pulling shit in for you for the, for a new relationship um but they're they also are like this other person is getting karma like they're getting their payback you know I feel like you could, if, if, if it is that situation, you went through a lot with this person, like a lot.